And it was another frustrating day for thousands of passengers who are in a holding pattern. Still, many of them, they've spent hours trying to rebook their flights. Many saying it's been very frustrating, difficult, if not impossible to do. And yet, they're still hopeful they'll make it out of here tonight. You're hoping to get on a flight on the standby, but you're not guaranteed a seat. Tony Cook passing time in the airport atrium. His flight to Kansas City canceled after the massive power outage. Cook's been stuck here since 1 o'clock Sunday afternoon, camped out at the airport overnight. You wait around, try to be patient, try to um, be personable, not, you know, get on anybody else's nerves because you don't want nobody to get on yours. And this was the scene in the South Terminal Monday afternoon. With the power restored, the airport packed as thousands of travelers tried to rebook flights. We scrambled the last two days. I have a flight that's taking me now instead of to Newark to JFK. With hundreds of flight cancellations, travelers scheduled to fly out of Atlanta Monday also being impacted. I heard about it this morning when I woke up and watched the 5 o'clock news and I thought, oh my, we got to go to the airport this morning. Stella Gaines waited at the airport hours after dropping Dropping off her grandkids, and they were scheduled to fly out this morning. Their mom called me and said they missed the flight. It was so many people, so now they got to be booked at three.